Welcome to my passion travel channel and I invite you I make content on tourism and subscribe to my channel and put a little like. Fishamuk, a traditional Khmer curry made with fish, coconut milk, and spices steamed in a banana leaf. Fishamuk is a traditional Cambodian dish that is popular both in Cambodia and in neighboring countries like Vietnam and Thailand. It is a type of steamed fish curry that is typically made with freshwater fish, coconut milk, lemongrass, galangal, kaffir lime leaves, and other aromatic spices. The mixture is then wrapped in banana leaves and steamed until it is tender and fragrant. The resulting dish is creamy, slightly sweet, and savory, with a delicate fish flavor that is balanced by the richness of the coconut milk and the heat of the spices. It is often served with rice and garnished with fresh herbs like cilantro or basil. If you ever have the chance to try this delicious dish, I highly recommend it. Khmer Red Curry, a spicy curry made with meat, usually beef or chicken, vegetables, and herbs. Khmer Red Curry is a traditional Cambodian dish that is known for its rich and spicy flavor. It is made with a paste that typically includes lemongrass, galangal, garlic, shallots, dried red chili peppers, and a variety of spices such as coriander, cumin, and turmeric. The curry is then simmered with coconut milk, vegetables such as potatoes, carrots, and onions, and a protein such as chicken, beef, or fish. The result is a delicious and flavorful dish that is often served with rice or noodles. If you enjoy spicy food, then Khmer Red Curry is definitely worth trying. Nam Ban Chak, a popular breakfast dish of rice noodles in a fish-based green curry gravy with fresh vegetables and herbs. Nam Ban Chak is a popular Cambodian dish that consists of rice noodles served with a fish-based green curry sauce made with lemongrass, galangal, kaffir lime leaves, turmeric, and other spices. The dish is typically topped with fresh vegetables such as cucumbers, bean sprouts, and mint leaves, and often served with a side of prahak, a fermented fish paste. It is a delicious and flavorful dish that is commonly eaten for breakfast or lunch in Cambodia. Have you ever tried Nam Ban Chak before? By Satch Krauk, a delicious breakfast dish of grilled pork served over rice with pickled vegetables. By Satch Krauk is a popular Cambodian breakfast dish that consists of thinly sliced pork marinated in coconut milk and spices, grilled to perfection, and served with rice and pickled vegetables. The name of the dish literally means pork and rice in Khmer. The pork is usually sweet and savory, with a slightly charred flavor from the grill, and the pickled vegetables add a tangy crunch that complements the dish perfectly. By Satch Krauk is a simple yet delicious meal that is enjoyed by Cambodians and travelers alike. Char Kwai Tio, a stir-fried noodle dish with shrimp, egg, bean sprouts, and vegetables. Char Kwai Tio is a popular street food in Southeast Asia, particularly in Malaysia, Singapore, and Indonesia. It is essentially a stir-fried noodle dish made with flat rice noodles, soy sauce, chili paste, and a variety of other ingredients. The dish typically includes shrimp, bean sprouts, eggs, Chinese sausage, and sometimes cockles or other seafood. The name Cha Kwai Tio translates to stir-fried rice cake strips, with Kwai Tio referring to the flat rice noodles used in the dish. It's a delicious and flavorful dish that is definitely worth trying if you have the opportunity. Lap Khmer, a spicy minced meat salad with fresh herbs and lime juice. Lap Khmer, also known as Larb Cambodian or Khmer salad, is a traditional Cambodian dish made with minced meat, usually pork or beef, mixed with toasted rice powder, herbs, and spices. The dish is typically served at room temperature or chilled, and can be eaten as a main course or as a side dish, 
The meat is typically seasoned with fish sauce, lime juice, sugar, and chili peppers, and is often mixed with lemongrass, mint, and other herbs. The toasted rice powder adds a nutty, toasty flavor and helps to absorb the flavors of the other ingredients. Overall, Lap Khmer is a flavorful and refreshing dish that is popular throughout Cambodia and is often served at special occasions and celebrations. Grilled Squid Fresh squid grilled with lime juice, salt, and black pepper. Grilled squid is a popular street food in Vietnam, especially in coastal regions where fresh seafood is abundant. The squid is typically marinated in a mixture of fish sauce, garlic, sugar, and other spices, then grilled over charcoal until tender and slightly charred. It's often served with a dipping sauce made from lime juice, chili peppers, garlic, and sugar, and sometimes accompanied by fresh herbs and vegetables like lettuce, mint, and cucumber. Grilled squid is a delicious and flavorful snack or meal that you can find at many Vietnamese street food stalls and markets. Number croc, a sweet and savory coconut rice flour cake filled with scallions, corn, and mung beans. Number croc is a type of Thai street food that is made up of small, fluffy pancakes. The pancakes are made by mixing together rice flour, coconut milk, sugar, and salt, and then cooking the batter in a special pan with small, round indentations. The pancakes are then topped with a variety of sweet or savory toppings, such as shredded coconut, corn, or green onion. Number crock is a popular snack food in Thailand and can be found at street food stalls or markets throughout the country. Have you ever tried number crock? Ang tre muk, a grilled dried squid snack, seasoned with chili and lime. The recipe for ang tre muk, also known as grilled octopus with lemongrass, is a delicious and fragrant dish that you can easily prepare at home. Here is the recipe, ingredients, 500 g fresh or frozen octopus, 2 stalks of lemongrass, 1 red onion, 2 cloves garlic, 2 tablespoons of soy sauce, 2 tablespoons of brown sugar, 1 tablespoon vegetable oil, ground black pepper, instructions, 1. If using fresh octopus, clean it thoroughly and remove the viscera. If using frozen octopus, thaw it completely. 2. Finely chop the lemongrass, red onion, and garlic. Mix them in a bowl with the soy sauce, brown sugar, vegetable oil, and ground black pepper. 3. Add the octopus to the marinade and toss well to coat. 4. Let the octopus marinate for at least 30 minutes or up to 1 hour for a more intense flavor. 5. Preheat your barbecue or grill to medium-high heat. Place the octopus on the grill and grill for about 4 to 5 minutes on each side or until cooked through and slightly crispy. 6. Once cooked, remove the octopus from the grill and let it rest for a few minutes. 7. Serve the grilled octopus with rice and vegetables, garnished with fresh cilantro and lime wedges. Enjoy your food. Kui Tiv, a noodle soup with pork, seafood, or beef, served with fresh herbs and vegetables. Kui Tiv is a popular street food dish in Cambodia that consists of a flavorful broth, rice noodles, and various toppings such as pork, beef, shrimp, fish balls, and vegetables. The broth is typically made with pork bones, dried squid, and other aromatics, and is seasoned with fish sauce, soy sauce, and sugar to create a savory and slightly sweet flavor. Kui Tiv is often served with fresh herbs, lime wedges, and chili sauce on the side, allowing diners to customize the taste to their liking. It is a delicious and comforting dish that is enjoyed by many Cambodians for breakfast or as a light meal throughout the day.